All right, ladies and gentlemen, everyone out there on YouTube, everyone live here with us on Twitch. It is Ermac Gameplay Reveal Day. And the arena is gonna bring the extra hype tonight. Everyone, welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in. It is the dynamic duo back on the mic trying to host yet another competitive MK1 event. Fabs, what's poppin', baby? How we feeling? We are feeling great. We got the Ermac the, the gameplay trailer. We got the arena back online. Commentary do over the years as well. Let's yes, sir. Even though perhaps I have a question for you, I have a question uh, for the entire YouTube community and for our live Twitch here. So, perhaps you know it already. I told you. I, I actually got an invitation today, chat. You know, from a beautiful lady who asked me if I want to watch some some Netflix with her tonight. Mm -hmm. And perhaps believe it or not, even though I'm I might regret that one, I said no. I have to host an MK1 show. Chat, let me know. Is it a mistake? What would you have done? But perhaps we Real take man. this seriously here. This is not your ordinary show. This is the arena at the end of the day, and that means a lot of players signed up, and they want to sweat today. And of course, that's what we're here for. Let me let me check what the chat is saying. The chat, of course, the first question from the chat is, how hot is she? Fabs, what what do we do here with this community? Just, just tell her, tell her I'm sick. You know, actually, be, be honest. Be like, I have to commentate. I have to host my arena lineups. I have to do some MK1. You That's know, true. call later. I mean, Fabs, we have we have our duties here. You know, we have to deliver. The people expect something from us, and so we don't take any breaks here. Because first of all, Erme gameplay reveal. We, we already made a video about it. Fabs, phenomenal the character might be one of the most interesting characters from a design standpoint for a long long time i absolutely love it i think the community agrees with me at least what i saw on twitter so far i think only mm -hmm. positive feedback and that is you know pretty rare with mk1 in general yeah. if you haven't seen the video yet go check it out it's it's amazing that our reaction was also really good as well i talked about some really important things about the future of this yes. game which is it's good of course it's good and okay, you know, everyone who hasn't seen it yet, feel free to check out our YouTube channel, Fabs and I. We already posted the video, I think, two hours ago. But today, of course, we're here for another reason, Fabs. Finals are right around the quad, uh, <laughs> right around the corner. One of our last qualifiers. And just a heads up for every MK fan out there. Next week, we're going to deliver Fabs. Blockbuster after blockbuster. Yes. The week. entire week is going to be filled with MK events. We have PS5 top 32 finals on Monday. Ooh. Ermac top 8 Ooh. on Tuesday. PS5 top 16 Wednesday. PS5 top 8 Thursday. And then if you think you get a break, no. Friday, PC finals top 32. Saturday, top 16. And Sunday, Top 8 PC Finals. Fabs, I don't even know how I'm going to survive next week. You know week. what's even crazier? I also have regional finals that week as well. That is disgusting. There's... So, we are, we, I'm staying busy. We are staying yes, busy. Yes, we're, we're, of course, on the grind here for this community. But we have an interesting lineup in the backpack as well with some interesting matchups. Let's take a look at it together. That's what the people are here for. We start with it's Linkway versus Dylan Lloyd. EU versus oh. NA, Sub Zero versus Rain. Perhaps give me oh. your thoughts. Yo, oh, this is good. Uh, I think, I mean, pretty good matchup overall oh, for yeah. both of these characters. Two right? fun players. Um, yeah, really fun players to watch as well. Flashy things we don't see, like not the top tier you see all the time. It's going to be really, uh, I would say, unorthodox. I've never seen them fight before. So it's going to be really, really good. Good. I'm excited for that Sub-Zero Rain, for sure. Fabs, are you excited for match number two as well? We have Ooh. the rematch. Taki Nara gonna meet the boy Joey, aka King Gambler again. And that honestly feels like an MK11 Grand Final showdown all over again. <laughs> I swear, it, it might be an MK11 rematch, like for the <laughs> old times, you know, and I love it. Uh, Taki Nara against King Gambler, probably gonna be a uh, Johnny piece against Baraka piece, maybe Ashra piece. Let's see what Taki Nara is playing. Might even pull up the Peacemaker if he's that confident. <laughs> yes, we're going to find that out later. We have the mini villain here as well, Evil Carnage. In his last match, he only down to his opponent, one of the most toxic sets I've seen in a while. Oh, man. And today he's going to meet the Sandman himself. It is so sad. Back Ooh. on the menu for all the Gears fans out there. And then last but not least, another rematch, Yo, actually. This is Poki Nuji. This is a rematch of the rematch of the rematches. <laughs> Pro comp. 3-2, Boki, 
and then also we and Arena, I think they also played as well. And Boki also won, I'm pretty sure. So this is a rematch of the rematch of the rematches. Nuji is preparing for this match in forever. Yes. He saw this, he was like, That is my enemy. I need yes. to go. And be prepared. The thing about Nuji is I say it every single time when we have him on stream, in my opinion, he is playing in Incredible in the last yeah. week, in the last mm -hmm. months. Honestly, one of the best Melina players in the entire world, in my honest opinion. But we are diving right into this first match. Before we do that, a big thank you here to our community. Fabs, thank you for the raid. Tigris and Maxiel. And of course, random thank Big Baba Frankie and Zamanu. Thank you guys so much for keeping this going, this community project, for always having our back every single day. But now, Fabs, seatbelts on. It's time. It is time indeed. Can't wait for this. Let's see what the players are cooking, of course. And uh, I'm hyped. Only I'm hyped number well. one as well. And the thing is, whenever there is a new gameplay reveal or gameplay trailer, right? Ermac today, th this gives us a little bit more momentum. And that is exactly what the MK1 community needs. And speaking of momentum here in the chat, just a silent soloist, our one man hype train with the five gifted subs to the community. Round Thank you so much. Five. We just love to see the support always here and Chameleon already making an appearance. Both of them playing Chameleon as well. One of the strongest champions I would say in this game. Very impressive from every single range on the screen. Safety, extensions, anti-air, yeah, insane kill. Basically ha has all the sauce, you know? Yeah. And works it all. well with literally oh. every character in the game. Yes. Something Lin Kuei, I just saw him do real quick. Is duck a grab into jump that thing. Wow. Oh, it's Link Way. I swear to God, oh. this man loves his little micro ducks, and he gets away with it so many times. But here, Sub Zero is swinging today. Rule number one of the ma this matchup against Zero if he, if you block the slide, don't swing after. Just wait, just wait, because he's gonna fan lift, and then he's gonna cook you. Slide fan lift. Very real. Oh, yo, that was good. Link Wei on life support, but we have the magic button loaded. Forward two into GG's question mark. Oh, can't punish that. Very close. Goes to the grab, oh. but Dylan just holding up, eats the slide for breakfast, and that is a perfectly timed grab from Link Wei. That was so chaotic. Round two. Fight. Febs, I'm already oh, nice. sweating, and we have just started. <laughs> Yeah, oh, the back throw combo! <laughs> Dylan Lloyd knows the sauce. Hold on a sec. Yo, uh, what are you scoring? Two portals portals? up, and now it's time to party for all the rainmates. The glaive! Saved him. Nice block. Nice punish as well. Dylan Lloyd on point with this. This might be his round. Look at his life lead. Oh, this is a scramble. Bro, these guys are pressing fast! Oh, this is so chaotic. He poked for the punish. Didn't get quite what he wanted, but this could be what Lin Kuei does to turn us around. Oh, Mix. no. It is Mix City here in the corner. Dylan trying to jump out gets entire to what a conversion. Dylan had the big life lead, but now... <laughs> this is only oh. slides at this point. The Melina Baru saved him on wake up. Lin Kuei got a bit too comfortable there. This was the most chaotic round I've witnessed in a while, man. That was crazy. I hope every set today is like that. Yeah, this is, I mean, that's what the community is asking for, right? They want high octane MK1. They don't want to see those zoners. They don't want to see boring stuff. They want to see players go in. And Dylan and Lin Kuei, they are delivering. And Fabs, you know who else is delivering? Our community, since we are sitting on a level three Hype train. Thank you guys so much for the support, for being here. More than 300 people already in the crowd with us. These guys are not shy of waking up, bashing, waking up, jumping, waking, hope specialing. They are just gaming, and I love that about them. Fabs, do you realize that actually both of them, they're just not blocking? Like, they're doing anything but block. <laughs> Lin Kuei, every that. time Lin Kuei plays, this guy does not like to block him. This guy, I swear, and I, I think that's a compliment to be honest. Like, how are you winning this? Uh, this is this is just beautiful to watch. And again, no block. We just hold north, and we just got a ten euro donation here from We Are Many, but you are one. Thank you so much for the support. In the meantime, Linkway taking the first round, perhaps. That was sweaty. Linkway jumping the grab into dive kick.
and then he jumps again and punishes the poke from Vinland Lloyd. I guess this is the lesson for both of them, because if one guy keeps jumping and punishing your grabs and your pokes, it means that you also got to stop being obvious with it. You know? <laughs> the chat is saying blocking is for Netflix viewers and that ain't us. That is true, chat. Yes, I, I literally sacrificed myself today, you know, for this community fabs just to be here. But of course, it is all worth it since you guys are my, my second family, so to say. What would I do without any single one of you? Nothing. So thank you for allowing us to host these events every single day. One of the biggest achievements in my life. And I honestly mean that. Thank you. Fight. Whoa, that armor is so good, man. I, I've never been in Mortal Kombat where your side is not good. Every time your side always finds a way to be good, you just combo it into it with fan lift. So sweaty. Didn't do much damage, but that positioning is all that matters. Can, can we switch the topic in my chat? The chat is saying, like, Rips, you're never allowed to get laid ever again. What are we talking about here? Can we go back to the MK1 talk? He topped it. Just jumps over. Why drop a combo? Drops a combo, jumps over, poke special. Uh, Bro, Link is optional. This man is sliding in these DMs over and over Round again. Fight. Link might have been my favorite player to watch because he's no fear. Meterless Burger. Uh, no meterless. Dude. Oh, I like that. Lillard wakes up with buttons and gets punished again. This is going. This is still going. He's still going. Chameleon is going to come back, I think. Still on cooldown. Chameleon is out. Oh, you froze there with this. Trade combo. Can you I get don't it? even understand what's happening. Slide into Fenlift. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, slide fan lip? No, he doesn't. Oh, he goes and again, of again. course, there it is. Link Wei slowly running away with the game. And now Dylan, he needs to find those answers and he needs to find them quick. This was chaotic. Just a sudden, someone saying, Rip's putting his bedroom fun off to the side like his finger. I mean, guys, you have to understand, this is li literally our job here, Fabs, you know? So we, we honestly take this very, very seriously. And that's the reason why we never take breaks again, because first of all, all these players, they sign up for a reason. They expect us to be here when we say so. And I mean... It is hella fun on top of that. So thank you guys so much for sticking around. Hope you enjoy the show. We have a lot of fantastic matches in the pipeline. Coming up next, King Gamla versus Takinana. The Battle of Champions, Fabs. Sounds like a banger to me, bro. That is going to be a slapper of a game. I cannot wait for it. Linquay already. Loki up by two. Got Frost. Ooh, I think you went Frost to contest the zoning. Yo, yo, you picked that up. You're beast. Thing is, though, Chameleon just like overpowers Frost in the way. Like, she's, she's so much more active in regards. Oh, he broke the third hit. Wasn't gonna give into anything. I guess he just wanted to get out of me, too. Oh! Oh, I like that down one. That was good awareness from Link by another opener. And here is the corner. Oh, that was risky. Seems like Lin Kuei is pushing the Lloyd into the corner more and more and more. Trade? No, nothing happens from that. 300 health for both. Man, anything can happen right now. Oh, wait. Oh! The world are special. Do not jump when we have Fatal Blow. We will be using it. Liquid, he is on match point. So close to that sweep here in match number one. Fight. And these combos look so fancy. Honestly, Sub Zero, whenever this dude gets started, it looks so fun. But of course, damage, you know, non existent. Just like my helmet. <laughs> 
<laughs> the friendly fire, man. <laughs> I had to say it before the chat said it. Yo, the crumble warlord. Oh, brother. Is the missile available? Mix, 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 mix. No. Oh, Dylan, you need to press brother. And again, this slide here in the end from Linkway. Dude, Linkway is so impressive. Sub-Zero. Dude, use the oh, boat, man. Yo, Linkway, is, is he on top 32 right now? We can actually take a little sneak peek at our ranking here. The thing is, that was one of the most offensive game styles I've seen in a while. Linkway yeah. decided, you know what? I'm going in today. Let's take a look at our lineup. So, is the boy currently in top 20? You know what, uh, Fab? Since wow. our, since our um, Discord is basically all automated, I can check his rank right now. Give me a second. Here it is. Ooh. His current rank is rank number 39 on oh, PS5, cool. and that doesn't include today's set. So, that might be the chance that Linkway is going to make it to our finals next week. Yo, Linkway, this is your week, man. And I'm looking at this. Nuji pretty much kind of locked in for finals as well. Kind of, kind of proud to see the boy in there, you know. Uh, yeah, very, very uh, polarizing to see all these positions that people are in, you know. It's going to be wait. hella interesting. We always talk about it when we talk about our current season. One of the most stacked seasons we ever hosted, considering that there are so many players across the globe competing literally on the highest level. This finale might be, it might be a generational one, Fabs. It might be really a generation of finale. I mean, every single season, man, becomes sweatier and sweatier. I mean, we some players don't show up, but then you get made like that ends up being complemented by three more god players showing up. You know, it's yep. just it's crazy. So, but coming up next, ladies and gents, it is time for King Gambler versus Takinara. The literal battle of giants happening in the arena today. So I'm very curious about the chat prediction. Who do you guys have? You get two minutes. We get the speedrun predict uh, prediction running here. Put your channel points on the line. Let's see who's going to take it. I see Ashra and Johnny Cage. That is a surprise. No Baraka here on Taki's end. Ooh. Ashra. You know what? I'm glad that Taki not... Never mind. I'm glad that he's been invested on the Ashra. Because he, he was uh, like... Whenever, you know, Baraka got nerfed, he was playing Ashra. And I think he likes this character, really. So, uh, yeah. When will you forgive me for that hat? But the thing but is, King man, Gambler, Gambler. Yeah, I was about to mention that, Fabs. Right. The neutral monster himself. King Gambler has so much experience. Gambler can... just knows. Hasn't thrown a single button yet, by the way. Yeah, Hasn't but... pressed a single button. The question is, can he outmove Ashra, Fabs? Like, is that possible? I think he needs to be more patient on offense, wait for the armor, Shadow Kick Goro, boom, punish that armor every single time. There we go. Ooh. There you go, he yeah, extra stun. In the corner now, what is Takanata's response? Sit down and block. Oh, there's a release of the block too early. Yo, that kills. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gambler is just so good at prolonging his offense, you know, extending his uh, turn. Patience with the pressing. Corner. Oh, don't counter poke. Safe jump. All these staggers, yeah, man. That was good. All these nice. staggers and called the back dash. King Gambla secured the life lead and now he has to cook. I haven't seen Takanata start like this, this thing, you know? It's just really hard to open up Gambler. Are we going to see Mix? <laughs> oh, he mixed him. Does I see a first time message in the chat from an account name? Made this account to sub to Rips Arena. <laughs> I swear to God, this community, you guys are wild over there. Nice blocks. Ooh, that was so difficult to punish. Plus five. Set okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, you know? It's tough. Takinada on life support, but one fatal conversion could change it, but he decided to block with his face. King Gambler takes the first round. Wow, I could. I feel like a Baraka might be the play here, because, like, 
either a Morocco or I would say a cameo that lets Ashra press more buttons in neutral. Because so far, we I, I couldn't see Takinata like a start his game plan, you know? Let's have a look if Taki is switching characters, actually. Might be like a Baraka Kano, Baraka Striker type beat. But his reason to go Astro, maybe because he doesn't like the, that matchup on Baraka, maybe? So let's have a look. Is it the switch? I see Baraka, at least in the character select faps. Is he gonna choose him? Baraka. Oh, it is time, faps. Maybe we should invite Pyrrhix into this hey. lobby so he can oh. uh, cheer Takinara up a little bit. <laughs> or distract Pyrrhix King Gambler. You know, both, both things work the same. Pyrrhix needs to be uh, like a voice, like an like a announcer voice on MK. <laughs> <laughs> we need a Barack announcer voice, man. He, he could do it for sure. He could do it. <laughs> yeah, Kali, that's right. That's what Pyrrhix is going to do. So Ooh. it is Baraka Cyrex. Interesting Dr. pick. Cyrex. A pick we don't see that often anymore, Fabs. <laughs> after the, you know, Why? most recent nerfs. Yeah, I mean, after the nerfs, everyone just doesn't like right. what characters to play. Fight. Here we go. See, Baraka has more freedom in pressing in neutral. But while well, Gambler did not press a single button, Shadow Kick Goro. Kills the deal. This is how it is. The grab will be coming. This is where Gambler starts grabbing people. Yes. Whenever the Gordon's on cooldown, he starts auto shaming you and going for grabs and stuff. It's so annoying, man. Uh, the good old Gambler game plan. Let's see if Tucky can adjust to it. No combos. Yes, sir. You still got those. I literally just got a notification from our YouTube site, Fabs, and a comment said, can someone Photoshop Rip's face on Ermac and call him Bald Mac? <laughs> yes, please, for, that, for the Ermac top face, it means Bald Mac. You guys Your watching this on YouTube, live. I hate every single one of you as well. Oh, talking nice. Oh, that is juicy, I like that. Losing. Good old pre-patch combo is still working. Fight. Your hair is mine, Bald Mac. <laughs> It's over. It's over. It's over. Yeah, it's over. But there's the wake of violence, sponsored by King Gambler. Oh, I saw the whiff punish attempt. Oh! Made this account <laughs> sub to rips. <laughs> With the prime sub. Thank you so much for the support, my friend. This dude actually just made this account to subscribe here to the channel and support the entire arena empire. You're a mad lad for that. I appreciate that. Oh, this could be dangerous right now. Goes for the mid. Uh -uh. Untackable throws. <laughs> here comes Goro. Taki on life support over there in the corner. This is your new home now. Good flawless block. Punish, but only gets the throw. Was that intended? Does he just want to side switch? Oh. You can't, have can't just, you just can't stop that. Back go. Gambler still in the offensive, man. He's like, yo, Sindel's watching? Hold on. Let me go crazy. Finds the gap. Throw combo, right? Yes, sir. Now more throw loops. Back three or throw? Keeps it simple. I just realized he does get good throw loops on this uh, on, on this team. It's crazy how Gambler in a team with no projectiles, right? He's still able to like force the opponent to like whip in neutral and just one away from people. Like you would think if you're going to let me just zone him. No, he doesn't let you zone him. <laughs> he just was sliding through the whole screen. 
Okay, Gabler, he, he always feels so comfortable, you know, in every single tournament. It looks like he's not nervous at all. For him, it's just another day in the office, fans. Wait a minute. Do I see my boy, Mr. Extra Handsome in the chat, Vendetta? What's up, brother? Hope everything is all right over there. Look, that's Johnny's out there, you know, this is looking over each other. Johnny players stay together. Just turn it. Oh, yeah, no, and we just do it on block, of course. We have the Goro safety in the back, and now Takinara is in trouble, ladies and gents. Oh. Johnny Cage wins. Uh, but I have to say, Fabs, it is, it is always so beautiful, um, because there are so many people like a family at this point whenever we take a look at our chat we see the same names every single day we see old faces return from time to time just like the boy vendetta i know he's super busy right now but decided to say hello regardless and that honestly means the world it is just uh, i don't know perhaps it's the biggest family i ever had and there are thousands of people out there and we can always put a smile on their face every single day with the content and uh yeah i just love it so thank you so much guys for watching, for always sticking around, and of course for making the arena what it is today. 2-0 Gambler, match point. Do you think Taki can make this reversal 3 0 Honestly, I see. I, I can see it, but it's going to be a huge amount to climb because like, this Johnny Goro is no stopping him. Oh, we go to Kano. There we go. Block strings are enabled here. No, oh, Taki not a special, man. When you least expect it, that overhead is coming. Half health already gone for Gambler. Oh, Taki, okay, now we are pressing buttons. Caught the back dash from Gambler. Pick up Parry and Taki with all the patience in the world. If you see Parry, go low immediately. Losing control. Round two. Fight. Oh, try to press, but he still had advantage even though he poked Perry. Safe jump off of the floor. 42% off for a safe jump as well? Dude. Don't mess with Johnny. Don't mess and with And of course, this is problematic whenever you're with a back against the wall versus Johnny Cage. But Taki this time at least finds a way out. Shimmy, Shimmy. That jails. Oh, he tried to whip punish Baraka? Not in this house. He's been swinging with no hurt boxes on his blade. Oh, throw. No tag from Takinada. I think they're both scared of Perez. <gasps> <laughs> no, that was actually disrespectful. Crowdy players are like in the Matrix. They just know. They just know, man. They own footies. Final round. Fight. King Gambler showing us again why he's considered as one of the best players out there. He's like, why would I play footies? I got Benny <laughs> move. Hey, yo, he's so quiet. And then he just throws that out. Oh, the illegal stuff. Safe launcher. That's lost blocks there from Takinata. We're just in the chip. Finds a way out. There we go. Breaker. The pressure. Oh, the Goro is low. Extending. Oh, this is tough. Safe jump now. Incoming. That guy does have armor. Maybe he can armor into uh, the potential Kato. No, oh, he gets opened up. And that is over yeah, wow. that's gonna be all she wrote king gambler sweeping his way to victory versus takinara ggs to both and i know that was a terrible connection on both ends i really hope we get some server adjustments very very soon yeah the servers have been really shaky Lately, I hope uh, once I think they have to start patching this game like brick by brick. I think whenever they do a patch, they try to do many things at the same time, and it kind of makes other things worse, you know. So if, if once they tackle the servers, we're gonna be in for a nice ride.
Oh, we're so we're in for a good time. And I see a four euro donation here from made this account to sub to Rips saying I would donate more, but sadly I have less money than Rips hair on his head. <laughs> Keep it up, lads. I love to watch the YouTube videos. Thank you so much, guys, man. I don't even know. It doesn't even feel right if I don't get roasted within an event fabs. I think it's it's part of the show at this point. It's just how it is, man. But coming up next, it is time for the mini villain, Evil Carnage versus Sosat. The last time we saw Evil Carnage, we saw a lot of teabags, Fabs. But the thing is, really? to teabag, you actually have to win first, and that's not gonna be easy. Not versus a player like Sosat. <sighs> teabags, man. Teabags, teabags, teabags. I miss Evil Carnage. You know, I miss uh, is, is Omni Man. Not many people play Omni Man lately, and I think that character is really, really fun. So. Let's see what he has cooked up here for us. <laughs> and Kali in the chat is saying, Rips, your bald head looks fabulous though. No cap. Thank you so, guys so much for always trying to cheer me up here. Whenever I feel down, this community has my back. But honestly, thank you for the support. We have close to 500 people here with us. In fact, that, that is an insane amount of people. Just imagine 500 people standing there in your room, bro, watching whatever you're doing. You? Next set Crazy. is in the pipeline though. Evil Carnage is here and so is so set. I cannot wait to see the chat prediction on this one. Two strong players, two players we see here very, very often. Let's take a look what the matchup is. General Shao, Omni Man. Oh, okay, General Shao. Shang Tsung's laboratory. At least you look somewhat threatening. My looks do not deceive. All right, let me see the cameos. Let me see how this goes. And you mentioned before, Evil Carnage is a semi, like, kind of low-key toxic player. But so is so sad. If you give this man a chance to teabag you, if, if you piss this man off, oh. Don't piss this man off. Nice punish that is the what clap. happens. So if you piss off so sad, this man comes in swinging. Yo, yeah, yo, this, fight, this version of Shao has 1,200 health, by the way. Built like a freaking Dark Souls boss. Hit for 40 on Imagine every, uh, if there's a second phase as well, you know, where he just stands up again. <laughs> he gets the hammer, man. He, the hammer just comes out. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Ooh, Evil Carnage still rocking the Omni Love. You see what he did there? He put the human shield of Tremor and then he buffed up his thing. His axe just for the, you know, in case. And that's standing to definitely one of the best buttons and oh. beautiful usage here of that armored no. launcher. Trying to play footies against Shao. Again, so sad Shao is insane. Hard. Yo, he blocked. And I am down too. Yep, sit down. No fly zone. Yo, the footies, man. The spacing from so sad is so impressive here. Keeping Evil Carnage in that corner forever, man. Plus frame. No combos. We got no combos. That is what? Look at this damage. Off the throw. Rip. 50 burger off of the what freaking the? throw. What the hell was that? 53%. This man just casually threw out the craziest Shao combo ever. From a grab. Huh? Oh, chat, we have a banger in the background playing. Can we get some ales in the chat? And here is the brute. So sad. No. He dropped the, 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 the Gearus man, and he's like, yo, this yep. Shao is the best. This is the new Soul Set chat. Make some noise. 1200 health? Hitting for 50? <laughs> huh. This is, this is dangerous. King Gambler saying, I love this song. Then this one is for you, Joey. And I think, Fabs, thanks for the memories is the perfect Omni title here General for this stream. Shot. Thank you guys so much for supporting us for more than three and a half years already. So long. Of time and it still feels like it's still the start, man. Yes. I don't know. It, it, something I have that feeling we're only like at, at the start of this journey, which is pretty impressive. It is only the beginning. We have so much stuff in the pipeline, so much, uh, so many things planned as well. I cannot wait to see what the future brings, especially not only with the best community in the back, but of course with the best team here next to me. Fabs, thank you so much for being a part of it. My pleasure. I'm grateful to be here and so sad right now, chasing. 
Evil Carnage seems to be applying uh, more movement, more aerial mobility as well on this team. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Making so sad work to get those buttons out. Oh, the flawless block is good. Oh. And right now, this chat is trying to get that hype train started. Leo, thank you so much for spending the primes up here on our channel. Down ones getting exchanged. Oh, this is interesting now. Oh, and <gasps> the back to lollipop swing. There we go. Puts crystalline on so you can switch into the aftershock for the throw combo. He already had a set up, by the way. Nice. Still set still. Gotta work for that. Has a lot of health left. They really got hit so many times. Yo, that was scary. Pick up. We got those. Oh, he, <laughs> no! he blocked the overhead and still got called by Trevor. That was so sick. So, so sad is insane. No way. All these little sequences he was winning are in impressive, man. Impressive. I like the armor didn't come out there for so set down. Little shoulder. You know, the, the, the chest bump didn't come out last round. Oh, trying to wake up what? No, only so sad is doing this off the tremor. I, I, I don't see people use tremor and block like that. Is he here? Is he here for the throw combo? No. He does. He does. That is such a, a late of, throw combo. A lot of people always forget about the strength of Sosat Shao. Most of the people, they always expect that gear is, but look at the boy go crazy. You get a Brutal? Oh! oh. God, what? He puts it on. No, this Brutal is insane. Brutality. This is my favorite Brutal in the game. General Shao wins. Yo, this is the strength not only of Shao, but of Tremor. So sad. This man is firing on all cylinders. 2-0 match. The thing is, Fabs, it feels like we just started the stream, but this honestly turns into a speedrun. We are barely live here for an hour, and this stream is just Omni flying by, General so to say. Kung <laughs> Lao, the gateway. Oh, ne Nero's here. Steel shop and steel. We are equally matched. The feeling is decidedly not mutual. Round one, fight! Okay, back to the match. Let's go. So sad. Showing why this, 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 uh... Why the Shao is demonic. Up 2-0. Crazy. And Evil Carnage is not an easy... Opponent at all. You can't just make it this in a cakewalk when you like, get things going. There we go. Little carnage. What's the knockdown? He puts himself in the cold oh, weather. The throw? <laughs> Nuji is saying we are speedrunning this for you, Rip, so you can get that Netflix date. <laughs> this community uh, has my back no matter what. Big mistake for so sad. Right. I mean, for Evil Carnage, which cost him a breaker. Oh, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now, any hit might send him to the Jover City. Wait. Oh, wait. Wait a minute, Faps. I took that. Yeah. He dropped that combo, lost his breaker, and so said just went crazy with it. Round two. Big choke from Evil Carnage. Nice. I'll have to give you some advantage on it, even though the nerd. Plus friends, armoring out of it. Oh, I'm going to go to standing too. The layers, man. Cooking, evil carnage. Finally get things going. Could have been a second round potentially, but now needs to be his first. Punish. Yeah, that's that switch as well. Nice, he side switches early because he knew he was gonna kill. Smart, I like this. You can you bring those guys as an Omni Man main, you know? Omni Man. That's what you can call him. <laughs> Yo, is that Big Boy Tremor giving Shao 
full screen options? That's what it looks like. Uh, set up, I think Evil Carnage expected the stagger and so set on match point. What was that down to? Excuse me. Next blocks. Looks like Evil Carnage found a way to control the neutral a bit better. Armor again. Not letting Sosad hold any plus frames, and this could be the start of the new first trio. If Evil Carnage wins one more sequence, that's Breaker available for Sosad, and then it's, it might be over. The way Sosad is literally outzoning Omni Man full screen, I've never seen that before. There we go. Breaker. No break. There we go. Oh, he's waiting for the side switch. That's smart. That's really smart, actually. Good tech. Get off me. And again, the standing two juggle. He needs to switch to Crystalline. There we go. He switched to Crystalline. Uh, rip. So yeah, I think he might kill. He so might kill. Oh, did you drop the bomb? And the overhead. overhead. That's going to do it. Another brutality. Three of them. Back to back to back. So said sending a statement. If Evil Carnage hadn't choked that first round, it could have been... 2-1. But dude, I think the most complicated thing about Tremor is being on the right stand so you can start your grab combos. And so said messed it up a little, but he still picked it up though. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Insane 3-0 though. Disgusting. His shower is not here to laugh, man. So set is here to game tonight, and that was a fantastic performance. GG's to both of them today. So set just a little bit stronger. Yeah, it's, it's disgusting, man. And perhaps you know what's crazy? We already made it here to the last set of the night, and it is a banger chat. What can we say? Boki is gonna meet our combo warlord, Nuji himself. The rematch. <laughs> That's going to be good. That's going to be good. Perhaps, uh, if you would have to choose one, who do you think is going to win this? We know that both of them are demonic. No. Uh, take. I feel like Nuji has been preparing for this matchup since he lost. I think <laughs> Nuji is going to win. <laughs> you that think Nuji good. actually waited for this moment? Yes. He's been waiting for this since birth, actually. This has been his nemesis, man. His, his home, this is his pro comp rematch. 100% on Boki. Wait, how did it switch from 100% on Boki to 100% on Nuji? What the hell is happening? <laughs> Cha -cha -cha is being, they're listening to my, oh, no way. My influence. My influence. Guys, you're forgetting that Boki is literally like, oh, this is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. They are letting themselves be influenced by me. But something I've noticed Nuji do a lot is the mix from Loci. And uh, Boki, was, last time I saw them play, Boki wasn't flawless blocking the Melina string, which kind of let Nuji do some stuff like string into jump back ball roll, string into back dash ball roll. Like Boki was fine. Like for the first time in my life, I saw Boki struggle to press the button. Okay, let's have a look. I expect, even though we had a lot of sweeps today on stream, this might be a game five. Okay, the block on it over at Nuji is seeing the future. Nice blocks, man. Nuji to oh, he didn't confirm. Didn't confirm. And Boki just what is that? What is that? Kick? Crazy. And Sorry in the chat is saying, why always so few matches? The thing is, guys, you have to understand, especially since Fabs and I, we are running this daily. Like, we are live every single day for like two, two and a half years now. I think without any breaks, adding more matches to it, especially with the preparation time needed and the, the graphics we have to prepare, it is just too much work. Especially considering that we already recorded an entire YouTube video today, Fabs, right? True, but you'll be see what Melina is doing. Yo, Nuji did some insane combos. Here, but yeah, guys, we are kind of like over scheduled sometimes. It's kind of hard to put like five matches rolling, you know, it's, 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 it's tight sometimes. But to compensate, oh, yo, this demonic, you can kill though. This first round has been insane. Oh, and Bogey gets it. No way. But yeah, this is a close to compensate match. this though. Next week is going to be like, like the, the, the longest week we've had. So many things next week. It's going to be crazy for sure. 
Yo, Nuji's been getting that low side combo so many times. Is Boki ready for it? Is Boki ready for it? Bro, these combos are insane from Nuji. We say it every single time. 44% off the low side on Mystery. Oh, I told you, man. Nuji sweep. This guy just typed in chat. Whoop, mid combo. Patience Good patience from, from Boki, yes. Nice patience as well. Reading Nuji's options back to back. And that is, you're, you're eating like, yeah, that's 75%. Okay, there's where you want to have you. Over there in the corner and, wait, did he just, I didn't even know you can convert that. What the, I, I literally saw that particular sequence for the, for the time. first time in my life. I need the replay. He's showing that he's also a combo warlord. Boki, what like, the hell yeah. was that? Here it is, so. What the? Since when is that possible? The six frame button there kind of clutched him, not gonna lie. Wait, perhaps, is, is Boki already playing on that Ermac patch and is playing like the buffed Kung Lao version? Or what, what, what is happening? On the Ermac patch. Oh, that killed me. Boki got the cracked pre download. Round one. Right. No, we have to investigate here. Oh, catching him, trying to... It's Nuji just knows the mind games, man. How much is this? We got two Melina size. Don't drop it. 50. F F Three Melina size. He knows. He knows. He knows that Nuji loves doing that one, two string and to jump back. Ball roll. And Nuji, you should not be doing that. Armor. Magic knowledge. Fan lift available. Actually, it's ball roll available now. Ooh! Like, I saw the Luigi back, man. This is Yo. Big Burger City. What is that breaker? The boat was kind of mad. Why did he break that? Uh, two <laughs> this might be the most crazy game we've seen today. Oh! Ball roll will destroy! It's, it's the curse of being a Melina main. Sometimes that ball roll will be coming. No J Julian. Insane. Fan lift combo into that beautiful stuff from Nuji. Oh, that is. Die. That is just a piece of art. Double Look side. at what the hell is this what? combo, Nuji? 280 damage off of the back throw. Bro, Fabs, this honestly looks like a complete different game. Is this is this even MK1 we are watching? The potential chameleon enables it. Oh man, yeah, Camille might be the best cameo for uh, Melina. There's just so much depth that she gains from that. Watch for the ball roll, watch for the ball roll! Cousin! Not how it works, Jake Live available. He doesn't like using Jake Live at all. This guy just only like a, a fan lift warrior. Oh man! Oh, that would have been so sick if Boki would have got that full conversion. Nuji trying to rob with the jump back ball roll as well. Yo, these guys are playing out of their This is a mind. crazy set, yes. I agree, Fabs. That's the first time I see back forward two into Gora connect. I feel like, yeah, they haven't been doing that move at all. Plus frames. This is so fast. Punish. Nice yep. Gets the little micro dash even. And again, Nuji back against the ball. The same sequence. Can the comeback happen? No Goro for Boki. Wait, <laughs> did his reversal not come out? <laughs> he just didn't punish it. Borrow available. And there's oh. the whiff punish. Boki. But as you mentioned, Fabs, both of them, they are playing out of their minds right now. This match is so close. This is a very, very high octane match. Man. Could have gone to anybody so far. Daniel in the chat is saying this is an amazing match. I can only agree. Let's see. Is it going to be the last round now? Or is Nuji slowly bringing this back? Goro Sundo. Had I been champion, the tournament... Since you weren't, your point is moot. Round one, fight! Oh, 
Spokey keeping that neutral. Oh, yeah. I think what's killing Nuji is that he is putting himself punishable in a lot of situations where yes. I think he's holding the thing is I think this would literally work versus 99% of the players, but the thing is, Boki, he exactly knows what Nuji is doing because they play each other so many times. You see that? He's so calm and neutral. He knows. It's not just matchup experience, it's literally player experience at this point. Fight. Oh, he As read Boki through his rage. Literally just forcing his way in. And again, Nuji. Over there in the corner, this is your new home now. Plus frames, you have to hold all of that. Mix, this is where everyone panics. Mix. Plus frames again. Both Boki is just being himself right now. Just making sure how dominant his game plan can be applied. No meter for Boki. The throw, and that is game. Wow, wow. Speed That's gonna do it. This, <laughs> this was literally Speedruns Arena, but don't get it twisted. A lot of interesting matchups, insane gameplay from every single player today. But Fabs and I, we want to say thank you to every single one out there for spending time with us today, for watching all these incredible fights. And let's be honest, Fabs, we have to keep these streams short here in the last week because next week, when we have finals literally six days back to back, it's going to be a wild ride. And we cannot wait to see who's going to be our Season 4 champion on PlayStation and on PC. And on top of that, of course, that Ermac Top 8 is waiting for us yes. as well. So chat. Big things coming. Big things coming. Big things are on the way. Thank you so much for being here. We're going to send you over to the boy Vape Coach. He is streaming right now. So you guys stay safe out there. We are, of course, going to return tomorrow with more MK1 action. It's going to be very interesting to see, especially how the rankings are going to change in the last week. Who is going to drop out of top 32? Who's going to make it into it? We're going to find that out tomorrow. So guys, take care. Stay safe.